Foundations The foundations support and distribute the loads undergone by a construction by transmitting them to the ground. The depth and dimensions of the foundations depend on the type of ground, which can be soft, compact, or firm. The softer the ground, the wider the foundations must be. Continuous strip footing. Continuous strip footing is essential in the case of a soft ground and recommended for other ground types. It is built following these steps. The steel reinforcement of the strip footing is placed onto the lean concrete to make sure it is well embedded in the concrete. It is important not to forget to use spacers. The rebars of the vertical ties are then placed to be connected to the foundations. Cyclopean Concrete Foundations The following steps show a correct use of concrete for the construction of the foundations. 1. Pour the concrete over the strip footing in successive layers of 10 to 30 centimeters thick. 2. Add stones of 10 to 30 centimeters in diameter into the freshly poured concrete. The proportion should be approximately 60% concrete and 40% stones. 3. Leave a space all around the tie columns for the concrete to be poured later on. 4. It is important to leave the foundations 20 centimeters above the ground level to protect the future building from ground humidity. Placing sewage pipes. The following rules show how to place sewage pipes when constructing the foundations. The pipes must be placed inside the cyclopean concrete foundations, above the strip footing, and below the plinth beam. The pipes must always be placed away from the tie columns and other concrete reinforcement elements.